What's on YouTube? It's Pete TT back at it with another Destiny 2 video. And today, guys, we have a little bit of news and information coming out of E3. This information actually comes directly from Luke Smith. Those of you who may not know who he is, he is the director of Destiny 2. And he had a podcast with Kotaku. They spoke for quite a long time. And while I haven't finished listening to the entire thing, that's what I'm going to go and do after this video. You know, they did talk about some very interesting things quite early on. One of which we are going to focus on in this video, and that is called Flashpoints. Now, I'm going to pull up a straight quote, but if you want to check out the entire podcast, then I will leave a link in the description down below. Go and check it out. Like I said, I haven't finished listening to it yet, but so far it is a good listen to. So... Flashpoints are designed to drive Destiny 2 players to a particular destination each week. That means either Earth, Io, Nessus or Titan. There they will discover activities like treasure maps and special enemies. The nature of the event should mean you find plenty of other players having a crack at the baddies. The rewards players will earn from Flashpoints are high level. Equivalent to a Nightfall tier reward from the original Destiny. Smith said specifically that even solo Destiny 2 players can participate, so you won't need to matchmake to get your hands on it. Smith didn't go into detail on what Destiny 2 players might have to do to earn their Flashpoint loot. Um, yeah, this sounds really, really cool to me, because as you all know, we have like monthly PvP events in the sake of Iron Banner. Now we have weekly PvE events in Destiny 1 with Age of Triumph and the weekly featured raid and things like that. I personally like the fact that there are weekly PvE events, and Flashpoint sounds pretty cool. Obviously, there's not a lot of information uh, in depth about what they entail, but the fact they're going to force us to a different planet each time, the fact they talk about treasure maps, does get my brain thinking. What else do we know is coming in Destiny 2? Well, we know there are going to be things like Lost Sectors. We do know that some of the treasure maps are going to lead to Lost Sectors. So, speculation hat on for a moment. What if we have to do some form of Noble Deeds, very similar to what we do currently in Rise of Iron in the planet? Lands where you do some patrols, you kill some things, you 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 know you do the Archon's Forge. Eventually, you complete some bounties that you get from Shiro in the Iron Temple. Okay, think very similar. We're in Destiny 2. We're in this weekly flashpoint. We're we're killing a load of ads. We're killing a load of mobs. We're doing patrols. We're doing all these different kind of activities on the specific planet that is that weekly chosen planet. At the end of it, you get a treasure map. This treasure map leads you to a lost sector that only opens up when it is you know that weekly flashpoint on that weekly. De uh, designated planet from there you get to go in you get to kill some more ads you get uh, you know a named boss come out at the end of that they drop you an exotic engram or you know you get some something that you go and hand into the cryptar or you know whoever else whatever other npc you might go and hand it into and you finally get a reward like i said this is speculation i don't know but from what they're saying, from what we already know is going to be in Destiny 2, I wouldn't be surprised if it worked along that kind of questified um, route, you know? But again, my, my opinion, guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below. Again, the link to the entire podcast will be in the description down below. I do highly recommend you go and check it out. And as I read the rest of it and listen to the rest of it, if there's any more other information, I will, of course, bring you videos. But yeah, that's about going to wrap this one up, guys. If you like the video, drop a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. There will be plenty more Destiny videos coming your way. And as always, Guardians, thank you very much for watching. Until the next video, I'll catch you all soon. Thank you.